What's up guys, I'm Nathonis here with a quick video on some solutions to the PC crashing problem for Witcher 3 Wild Hunt. If you're playing Witcher 3 on the PC, then you may be experiencing frequent graphical crashes. The game's audio keeps going, but the game itself freezes and has to be closed using Windows Task Manager, which isn't very fun. And this problem seems to be limited to Nvidia graphics cards. Well, uh, I did some digging uh, to try and figure out what's going on, and here is what fixed the crashes for me. Okay, so the first thing you want to do is install a graphics driver removal software. I personally used uh, Display Driver on Installer, and you can find the link to it in the description. Uh, so after you install that program, go ahead and remove your uh, graphics drivers and reboot the computer. After this, uh, go to NVIDIA's website and search for drivers for your specific graphics card. So in my case, uh, that's the 660 Ti. Now here is the important part. Do not download the latest drivers. The game kept crashing for me when I downloaded the newest drivers that were released uh, just on May 18th. Instead of that, uh, you want to use the older drivers. So what I, what I did is I used the ones that were released on February 10th, and that worked fine for me. Also, during the installation, uh, make sure to choose Custom instead of Express Installation and check off NVIDIA GeForce Experience. This program may be part of the problem, so it's better to just leave it uninstalled. Okay, so once you're done all of that, uh, go ahead and open up your NVIDIA control panel. Uh, you can do that by going to your start menu or whatever other way you want to use. Uh, and then go to manage 3D settings and then find uh, power management in the list and change it to prefer maximum performance. And don't forget to click apply once you're done. Okay, so doing all of this fixed the crashes for me, but of course everybody's case is different. If you're still crashing, I would suggest uh, switching the game to full screen instead of borderless window, and also just lowering all of the game's graphical settings down to low. Alright, so I hope this was helpful, and if you guys have your own fixes that worked for you, please go ahead and share them in the comments.